Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3. If you're truly low, this injury the mad. Hi, Lord of Flosses, Harbor Rangers, Spiffing and Glow to you, Boxes Madman, Good to Spike to 13, and all around little guy. Now, I was. I opened this menu to make a joke about the fact that I have killed exactly 200 people, and I have killed three creatures too many for it to be ex exactly twice as much. I'm apparently to become good, but that's okay because that means I can get a super mutant friend if I go to the right place. Which could be fun. I wouldn't mind the super mutant friend. Um, turn off the light so we can sneaky sneaky. Do the sneaky sneaky in the cell phone thingy. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Let's find her. No? Seriously? Fine. Oh. You on the hand. Get back here. I'll back you up. Okay. So, that bastard got my barbecue stick. That's okay. The other bastard got his head cut off with a laser. Even better. But, 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 but. Where is the thing is at? Oh, also, from what I read, the murder pass is full of super mutants, so uh, that's gonna be fun. I do believe, I do believe, even I may find some loot there. I don't want that whiskey. That whiskey will serve me no use. Anything in that box? Does it matter? Can't fit in there. Alrighty then. Quick save again. And uh, uh, I don't have a quest marker. Why don't I have a quest marker? I want a quest marker just to be safe. Oh, this just isn't a quest marker. Okay, so more corpses. Exactly what was necessary. Oh. Does it look like there's anything there? What sort of structure was this? Because usually these uh, side rooms were in the entrance, weren't they? I suppose they can be used elsewhere as well. No one has forbidden them that. Oh, you're a master again? Take these five shots in your head, face thing. Please make them critical, so I can kill you. Oh god, it looks one of, like one of those uh, ash zombies. With a big hole in his face. Except now the blood spreaded off because I killed the bastard. Oh well. It was nice while it lasted. The old Morrowind reference. Okay, maybe I should stealthily stealth. Like hold down shift, sprint. Except it is shift to walk. Right then. Make it dead. That's gonna be a challenge. I wonder who else is now aware of me. Because if it's only the hammer man, he may be able to do it without any issues at all. And it was just him. Good. Alright then. Because I don't know where I'm going, I'm just going to go to where he came from. So, what's an empty locker? Can I fit in there? No. And since there is no telekinesis plasmid in this game, I won't be able to get anything from there. Oh. Hell to no. I can't die for you, Super Music Master. 
I wonder if a headshot of this will hurt a lot. Oh, don't have enough action points. Let's try it again. This guy take a lot of action points. Alright. Now? Now. Oh, it doesn't really do a lot more. Switch to that again. These masters aren't too much of a threat, but, you know. Still safer not to f get killed. Is it safer not to die? I'm not actually even sure. It's certainly m more useful to my job objective. You don't need to co die dance anymore, Mr. Copsman. Get it dead. No. Can't open very hard locks because I don't have enough luck picking skills. Maybe I shouldn't walk around with the lamp on if I'm trying to be stealthy. Yeah. Yeah. Might be smart. Anything on the other side of this? Not by the looks of it. Oh! Where did they come from? I didn't quite notice you before, sir. These have these headshots. I made them myself. Okay, that's a lie, let's make them. Close enough that it doesn't really make a difference. There you are. Oh, you're another master. That's a lot of masters. Where you, where's your servant set, yo? Barbecue stick is what you get. That's right. Barbecue stick. Best kind of stick. Come up, grab everything. Uh, also, switch back to gun and stealth. Good. Save the world. And the cheerleader, if we're at it. I'm not sure we can actually find the cheerleader here. Oh, let's check over here, though. Yeah, hello. Taking that, sure. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Certainly that. Quite a good place in regards of all the looting. At least I like the laser rifle. The rest, uh, you know, is kind of run of the mill. Okay, so check the safe. See if there's anything secret or safe in it. Is it over here or is it all the way down? Oh, it's somewhere over here. Uh, not over there, over there, but like here or here. Okay, now I'm gonna afraid. Get out. It's like sky ray all over again. Because that had some seriously enhanced locking lock picking difficulty. Okay, I'm gonna take the caps and the stuff. I think I might have to find someone who sells those oil pins. Wasn't that weren't there actually a lot of people who did that? I just kept kept ignoring the option because I kept forgetting about the option. I think that was the case anyway. What is this place? No, it's the very hard luck. I see. Oh. Hello. Do you mind if I shoot you in the face repeatedly? When you keep walking towards me, like you need to kill me. Good. Wait. I'm gonna get that. 
so let's just keep going down and down and down and kill everything we see. Hmm. Oh, wait. Uh, let's have a plan and then we actually see me first. Well, actually, he didn't see me first, but before I can fire. He's out of the headshot. Oh, that's... Once again, a matter of a couple of too many enemies. Um, anyway, we have so many Chinese assault weapons, I should fix one up. Oh, that's full. Right. Never mind. Uh, fix the hunting rifle. That, that apparently didn't really need much, but okay. Uh, fix that. We switch the minigun because why not? What happens if I do this to you, sir? This can't take me here forever. I'm not sure they will die. Eh, they did. But it wasn't really the wisest course of action. Okay, I'm gonna switch to something different. How does this one work? I haven't really played with this one. Uh, also, heal quite a bit, sir. Thank you. Yes, I did refer to myself as sir. Because I could. What else? Alright. Now, where is the Gek? Are you the Gek? You're not the Gek. I wonder if they have a recipe here for an item. Because I think they might. There's quite a few related things here. Oh, there. Ah, it was nothing. All right, I was worried there for a second. What is this? Mm-hmm. Apparently, the what is this funny? And I'm too lazy to read the rest of it. Oh, but they probably shouldn't. It's important, probably. Alright. Maintenance code RL00 Green. Issue dormitory water dispensers outputting water with a foul aftertaste. Engineer Daniel Costa. The water filtration system, the reclaimer was adding a bit too much chemical rebalancer solution in the process. This gave rise to a buildup of alkalines in the water. I checked with the medical section and the water shouldn't pose any health threat. The taste should return to normal in approximately 4 days. Rectus spice section power outages. Mm. For the last five weeks, we've had periodic interruptions to the power grid, and the sections will lose power for approximately one to six minutes, then return to normal. By installing monitoring meters, I traced the issue to sudden immense power spikes in the main reactor. My fear was the reactor was having a major malfunction, but it turns out that it's due to a power draw that the experimental section is creating. Whatever they are using in there is way over the limit for acceptable power consumption. I temporarily remedied the situation by having the backup reactor kick on when needed. I don't like to do this, but I have no choice until I figure out what they're up to. Oh, oh, too, much, too far out. Come on. Number four. A Vortex crappy handiwork is at, the, at it again. I have spent the better part of a month patching and rebatching the radiation purge system that vents excess radiation from the GEC chamber. I have no idea why this system keeps failing. I suspect the system is simply inadequate and can't handle the amount of radiation it's purging. Recommend installing a new purging system as soon as I can. Get one gobbled together from spare parts. Should have it ready in about a month. The mess hall food grid constitution system is outputting the Monday night dessert tapioca pudding in an odd bright orange color. This was a simple fix, the color matrix was simply misinterpreting instructions from the main brain and outputting incorrectly. I replaced the interface and the button now outputs its proper hue. Before my fixes... Wish all my fixes were this easy. I was summoned into the overseer's office and met with Dr. Merrick who had heads up the experimentation section. 
He informed me that one of his devices, what he called an EEP chamber, was beep. It was a strange device, but I managed to beep, which didn't fix the problem. I then tried to beep, which seemed to bring the device back online. I'm not sure what this device is for, but beep, if I know. Alright. This is the only place I could think of hiding this message. In the event that anyone reads this, please try and get word back to Vault HQ that something very wrong is going on in the experimentation section. Something they keep referring to as the EEP. My wife, Mercia, was diagnosed by the medical section as having some sort of di disease they wouldn't identify. She's dead, and those sons of bitches won't even tell me why. From talking to people, I've discovered that many are dead or missing. Checking this with the medical records section gets me nowhere. This is getting out of hand. It's time to deal with this my way. They took my wife from me. Now I'll take their lives away if they don't give me some answers. I'll give them some extra help in my safe. I can't find this place anymore. Accessing this message will unlock it, but if I don't come back, grab the stuff and save yourself. Well, that's kinda lame. I was hoping to pick the lock. Well, fine. Uh, repair my gun. Look at that. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'd say it's quite, quite good. Was there a door here? No. There's a door here. Then how did the mutant see me? And when? I don't really see a marker on the map. Oh well, I, I'm sure I'll find him next episode, so thanks for watching, I'll see you then. Next time on Fallout 3. That's a beautiful view of your head, sir. This is how we usually kill enemies in uh, Mountain Blade Warband with a crossbow. I go under them, and uh, in an angle that they can't hit me at, I shoot them in the head.